Okay, Greg Barnes, go ahead. Hey, Armando. Uh, Roy told us a little bit ago that, that he continues to push you, and uh, we've heard him say that a lot you know, over the last year and a half. Uh, has that has that kind of sunk in for you, and is that motivation for you and one of the reasons that you've played so well of late, especially in the tonight? Yeah, I mean, Coach, he knows in my skin. i probably say he go the hardest on me on the team. I mean, um, yeah, I mean, it's I mean, I get kind of pissed off, but I mean, I want to go out there and win, so it's all good. Andrew? I know he means goodbye, too, so. Sorry, Mondo. Andrew, go ahead. Mondo, aside from RJ's scoring tonight, what have you seen that's different in his game, especially when he's at the point, the way he kind of manages things and sees things out there that is a sign of his growth in the last five or six weeks? Yeah, I mean, when he's aggressive, I mean, he's hard to stop. I mean, he can shoot it. He's so quick, small. He can get in different spots easier than a lot of guys with just his size. I mean, I mean, his facilitating has been getting a lot better. So, I mean, he's been great. And he's just growing. Brendan. Hey, Armando, when you say that Roy gets under your skin, what do you mean by that? Like, did he know how to push your buttons from day one, or has he, like, slowly figured it out over time? 100%. I mean, he, I'm telling you, like, he's just relentless when it comes to me. He's always riding me every single day. It's, it's always he's just at me. So he know how to get me in that mood. So and it turned me up. So I had to go out there and go crazy. Is there something specific he says or does? He just used the word soft a lot. And I don't like when he was saying that. And he kind of was trying to say they was punking us. So I just had to go out there and just show it. Thank you. Adam Smith. Armando, on the subject of possibly being punked, was there uh, was there any sort of adjustment, like technically, that you all had to make at halftime? You only had two offensive rebounds in the first half, and then you turned it way up in the second half, or was it just a matter of effort as opposed to something technical? Uh, I mean, I thought they, they had a good uh, strategy at the beginning. They was uh, doing a good job of just boxing us out, meeting us early, but... I mean, we got four good bigs, so eventually we knew they was going to wear it down, and that's in the second half. I mean, every play we go into the board, so eventually it was going to wear it down. Luma started fouling, getting fouls and stuff like that, so it just made it a lot easier. Okay, uh, last one, CL, and then RJ is almost ready. CL, go ahead. Armando, what does this win say to you about the maturity of this team now? Is, is this a game you, you feel like you guys – would have still won probably a month ago, or or have, do you feel like you guys have uh, have made steps forward? Uh, definitely not. We won the one this game a month ago. Um, we're just getting better and just tapping into our full potential. We know it's when to go home, and we kind of know we sold ourselves short. Just at the beginning of the year, there's a lot of games we know we could have won. Honestly, going into every game we played this year, I feel like we were the more talented team, but just teams have outplayed us. So now we're just finally starting to. Everything's starting to click, and once everything clicks, we're going to be a scary team with just how talented we are. All right, Armando, thank you.